you want to take uh, someone from us, but how can we work our magic without him without a man? I will let uh, if you can bring me a better man, brave hunter, someone from. No, can I just kill you? No, you die! Oh. 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 Yeah, no, I'm not giving you another person. I'm not letting you do this. Yeah, I'm taking your request and I'm it. You cowardly thief! Shut up. Guard! Do I have a bounty? Do I have a bounty? No, then shut up. I'm here to save you. Nope. No. It's a bedroll, so he might be spending the night here. Actually, I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna spend the night here with him. What's this about? Shut up, I'm saving you. Let's uh kill these guys. Make it quick, Outlander. It's a quick save though. Is my weapon out of charge? Yes. That's right. I'm waiting. Yeah, you're next. You will suffer greatly. Suffer. Oh, well, oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Let's uh, take two of these. Oh my God. Yeah, I'm gonna die. He's stop doing that. Mm. Oh. oh. Damn, I need to restock my potions and stuff. Um, yeah, let's take this. No, no, no. Uh, let's head back in. Quick save, that was tough. I think I'm out of, yeah, I'm out of ordinaries. I only got the cheap ones, or whatever it is. Yeah, cheap. Hey, buddy. You have dealt with, the, with my captors. I will find my way back to Ezerba and continue my speech with the Empire. I guess I don't gotta deal with you. We're gonna spend the night here. Roast you. Uh, okay. Let's see if I can cook all this stuff. Where's the roasting? Yeah. Damage the tea. Empire roasted. Oh, I guess I don't have any crappy fish. Nope. Alright, whatever. Um, I'm gonna spend the night here. I'm, I'm sure, hopefully I can use that bed. Drink some water. I can. I must be going, no, so I if can. you could make it if quick. If you must be going, then go. What's the first on my list now for food? It would be the hound meat. All right, well, let's, 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 let's see. All right, the roasted meat. Okay, whatever. Let's... No. Can I sleep in your bed? Nope. Well, I just realized something. Divine intervention. Let's see if it takes you with me. Actually, real fast, I want to see what this cooking pot does. Get out of the way. Some sleep. We find some traders, get some more potions and things. Wolverine Hall. Hmm, never been here. Um, where's my friend? Shit. Damn it. Oh, 
I'll be right back after I load it. Alrighty, folks. I am having a lot of trouble with this new microphone. As you may or, not, may or may not be able to tell, I know it's been a while. It's been a bunch of parts since I've gotten a new microphone. I still don't have it sorted out. I'm really sorry about this. Um, first off, might as well start getting our journey back down to Malagmar. We might, I think I might just cut to uh, Saran. I'm gonna head down to uh, that um, ruin. The Dwemer ruin. And then um, just cut over Saran. Anyway, I've been trying my hardest with uh, why am I going so slow? With getting this thing to work, but like it keeps like the settings that I that I make it like it just changes them on its own. So that's that's really annoying. But um, let's get a torch out. And it really pisses me off. But like I just, I don't know what to do about it because I just I'm just too quiet all the time. And, and the LP is suffering for it. And I'm like I really love recording this and I'm having a lot of fun doing it. But like. I'm worried that people aren't going to want to watch it because of how terrible the audio is. Like, I feel like it's better quality, like, I'm clear, but, like, I'm just not as loud. Are you still following me? Good. But I'm just not as loud, and that, like, really worries me. Because this Let's Play is important to me. Uh, this is my first role-playing Let's Play. This is my first modded Let's Play. And it's my, well, my first Let's Play of um, Morrowind. And it's like it's pretty important to me, so I want to get it right. But I'm having a lot of trouble getting it right because it's to get damn audio. And I don't think there's a way for me to edit it. Like, edit my voice to make it louder. So I don't think I've done, like... I don't think... Because my, my voice audio and my game audio, I don't think they're separate. I think they're together. Let me see if you're hostile on me. If not, you're gonna die. E either way. Give me your meat. Oh yeah, we took pick up that alcohol for celebrating later. Anyway, we're about nearing the thing. I think I'm loud enough. I I went into the settings and I changed them again. But, I don't know if it kept them. I'm hoping it did. Yeah, I don't get this, this frame rate counter at the top. It says 30, but I'm but I'm saying like 35. I don't get it. It's strange. Whatever. But, uh, if we get to Saran, I'm going to, um... Take the Silk Strider to uh, Vivek and then get a, sh a boat from Vivek to Ebonheart. We've never been to Ebonheart, even though I'm pretty sure it's the capital, the imperial capital of um, Vardenfell. So it'd be neat to go there. We'll end up finding ourselves there eventually, I'm sure. Because I, I know there's Imperial Legion quests that, that you have to do there. But we are not of high enough rank to do it. So, not right now, we're just heading to Saran. We're gonna head, uh, kinda south, southwest. What was that? I saw, ah. Like, when I was looking back at the audio, I was, during that fight outside the, uh, tent, it was really loud, like, that kind of, I couldn't hear myself talk when, um, this stuff was going on. I don't know if it's just the audio for the game, so I'm going to try turning that down. Is that it? I don't know. It seemed like mostly it was the, um, effects, like the magic effects and stuff like that. So if I turn that down, would that make it better? I don't know. Oh shit, there's someone attacking. Oh. At least you didn't get killed. If like if that happened, I'd be I would that would be the end of it. Like I wouldn't 
um, resurrect her or it. If he died, she died. Because that's not something I could have... That's fair and square, really. Let's just head this way because it's towards Belmore and all that shit. So. But Saran, Saran is the goal. Because of the Silk Strider. We don't want to get to like Pelagaya or someplace that doesn't have transportation. So. Oh shit. Son of a bitch. I shouldn't have done that. Because he wasn't going to attack me. Now he's going to run away. Run to the lava. Run to the lava. Get yourself killed. In the lava. Come on. There you go. Hit him. Shit. Die, please. I don't feel like having to deal with it. It's like, there's a cave right here or something. Oh, there's... What is that? Die. I think he's coming back at me. Die, die, please die, please die. That was my... I'm sorry. You would have been endlessly running away and endless combat. What is this? Is this a place to rest? Could this be a place to rest? I hit my mic. Alright, again. If... What's its face? Him or her dies. Don't run into the lava! What are you doing? Alright, get inside. If he or she dies... Um... Well, damn it. Uh, what if I disable the lava? Let's do like a real save. What would happen if I disabled the lava? If I would spell disabled right. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. In. Underscore lava. Underscore. 1024. What the hell. Okay. Now. That's just stupid. That pisses me off. Let's go. Come on, 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 come on. Over here, over here, over here, over here. You suck. Alright, I have to disable this lava too, right? Hey. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Hey. Speak quickly. Come here. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I hate you. I hate you so much. Stupid. Well, I guess that's not going to work. So, that quest is done. I guess I'm not going to, um, Ebonheart. Whatever. You want to know something kind of em that I found embarrassing? That Well, it wasn't me that was embarrassed, but I was embarrassed for the other guy. Um, so, a mod recently came out for, um, Medieval 2 Total War. The Elder Scrolls Total War, I'm sure... Some of you heard about it. And there was this guy playing, like, I think he's from Australia or something like that. And I was watching it, because I, I just wanted to see the mod, and it's actually a really good mod. It's really nice. And, whoa, that was weird. And he was talking about, he was playing as the Empire, and there were territories that you owned in Vardfell, because you were the Empire. And, um, he was talking about 
Ebonheart. And you know what he kept calling it? Ebony Heart. Constantly, he would call it Ebony Heart every single time without a, without fail. And like, I was getting really pissed off. <laughs> I was getting really annoyed because like it's cl it clearly said Ebon Heart. There was no E, I, or Y or anything like that. And I don't I don't get why he kept calling it Ebony Heart and stuff like that. It was just whatever. Oh, what are you doing? What is that? Let's start running. Shot that shit right out of this guy. Ooh, cool. Bone meal? Not really. Let's walk now. Um, but yeah, he's mispronouncing stuff left and right. Like, some of the things you can understand mispronouncing them and stuff like that, like, some of the places in Morrowind, because, I mean, no one has ever told anyone, like, I've never been heard how to pronounce Pelagiad. Pelagiad, Pela, Pelagied, Pelagide. I don't know. But, um, that's the way things are, honestly, but that's just it. Who the hell are you? Well, I'm just kind of freaked out right now. Like, he doesn't know what to think of this. What? Is that a piece of art? I don't even... An ash... An ash fondling. Like, these things are obviously evil. You will suffer greatly. Uh, start running. And a naked woman. Borm... Would love to have a naked woman run at, run at, running at him, but not like that. Huh. Borm does not want a naked woman running out. Right oh, out. Jesus. <laughs> These dreamers. What the hell is this? What the hell? Borm is so good. Like, he's actually really worried. He doesn't know what the hell to think right now. What the hell is this place? Some kind of dark elf ritual? Someone said something about the sixth house. He's heard about the sixth house. Sixth house. But he doesn't know what it is. He knows it's he knows it's not really that like great. He knows it's bad. And uh Sixth House Bell Hammer. Value five thousand. Weight seventy five. I don't even know if I can carry that. Oh hello. Uh that's worth a lot. Ooh, yes please. Uh, not really worth it. Um, ooh, that's worth it. Oh, yes, please. These two are both. Uh, that's worth it. Worth its weight in gold. Alright, uh, these two are both locked. Quick save. I do have those lock, open lock scrolls, if I need them. Which I'm sure I'm going to. Screw it, just use them now. How many do I have? I have six. And let's use this other one. What do you got in here? Nothing! Let me guess. 155 gold, okay, that was kind of worth it. But, uh, this hammer. Thinking about the hammer. No. Ain't gonna happen. Wait a minute. I just realized something. Now that I don't have my follower with me, I can go to, uh, I can use a divine intervention to, um, Sadris Mora and sleep there and then get it. Yeah, let's do that. Screw that. Screw this. Let's do that. And. <sighs> 
We're gonna go get some sleep. Because it is the middle of the night. <sighs> Wait, where am I now? I'm in Pelagaya. I guess because I moved a little bit. Oh well. I mean, it is my favorite place as a character, or as a player. So, I can't complain. It is two... Excuse me, it is two in the morning. As the armor. Here is the tavern. We're just going to go and we're going to get some sleep. I'm not really interested in getting anything to eat or drink right now. I am, however, going to re-equip the ring. You're right in the what is this about? All right. All right. Twinning. From where do you it. hail, friend? I would like a room. I'm just yelling over these people. I want a room. Thank you. Oh, great. Disable. There we go. No biggie. Unlocked. Alrighty. Let's get to bed. We're tired, and we're just going to fall right in bed. I'll uh, see you guys after the sleep. Alrighty, we're back. We didn't sleep very long. Uh, we only slept for... Uh, um, six hours. So, um, just because we wanted to get an early start on the day. And uh, head back to uh, Balmora to, get, to turn the quest in and stuff like that. So, we're going to get some uh, grilled beef. Get some grilled turkey, or did I say turkey? Chicken leg. Um, Cyrodiilic cheese. Let's get two of those. Vegetable soup, not really. Yeah, that's, that's that's really all we need. How's our water doing? Two left. We could just refill it outside. Yeah, let's just refill it outside. What is this about, Cyrodiil? Um. Yeah, we're just going to refill the water over here. Drink some water. Refill my water skin. Is it full? No, not yet. Cool. What is this? There must be something about you. Like something on you. That makes you like this. I'm just going to leave it. I don't care. What is this? It's just a trader. I'm going to head to the armorer first. So I can repair my gear and purchase any uh, repair hammers if need be. How you doing, sir? Our brother. Um, put my shirt. Did I? I think I took my shirt off because of my cape. I think that's what came off. I don't really have anything to sell here. Let's um. You got, a, you got something over here. It's a, it's a fire. Meat. This is your living quarter, so I'm not heading up there. Let's just repair this stuff and say it got repaired. Cause this guy, all this guy offers repairing, right? Excuse me, brother. Yeah, he offers repairing. You don't happen to take? Nope. Uh, Flynn? No. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that got taken off because of the uh, cape. Let's try that. Yeah, it did. That's no big deal. I mean, we have our armor over it anyway. We can just say that we're wearing it. Because I don't like how, like, it kind of sucks that in the other games, in Oblivion and Skyrim, you can't wear clothing under your armor. Because, really, you would wear clothing under your armor. I'm pretty sure. Because that would be kind of uncomfortable. But, whatever. I think if I ever did a, uh... Oblivion or Skyrim Let's Play, I would have a pair, like, a set of clothing with me, just for realism, you know? Because I disposed of the corpses, those things stayed with me. Uh, these two rubies. This breathing water book. Ooh. Got anything for me to buy from you? Do you have any potions? Potions, potions. No, no potions. Well, that's a bummer. Uh, give me, uh, this back. Ooh, this one, give me this back. There we go. 
You want that, Flynn? No. No! Book. Uh, give you this. There we go. That works. Alright, let's see if we can find anyone that sells potions and things. Might have to go back up to the, uh, the castle. The fort. Brother. Fort Pelagiad. Have to readjust my headset on my right ear. I don't know if you heard that. I hope you didn't. Whoa, bro. Don't ask, don't tell. Donation. Restore attributes. Just cuz. What do you got? Anything good for me? Ugh. Sorry, I had to readjust it again. Nothing for me? Gotcha. Uh, you. You're just one of those guys bar spells ooh what you got restore all the attributes and all that jazz I might make a restore strength thing ooh ooh ah uh, yes sure it's he it's health so I need it um, I might make a restore um, strength amulet or something like that or maybe try and get restore every attribute on self all right, I'm listening. Oh, sir. There we go. What do you got? Fun stuff. Tomatoes, a lemon. Get a lemon. Pear, orange. What? Lard, ham, cornbread, beef, cheese, bread. Yeah, let's just get a. I just got a lemon just for fun. Uh, how, how do I get out of here? Is this out of here? It's the north wall. It's right here, isn't it? No, it's not. It's over here. My athletics raised to 30-something. 30 31! Woo! Oh, that's one of my main skills, too. Good. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. We are headed back to Moon Moth Legion Fort to hand in our quest and hmm, hand in our quest and rest for a day and then get a new one because we were out for today is day 24 when did we get that quest uh, got it on day 19 so we were out for five days so we're tired anyway Got a little bit of a journey ahead of us. What's Move it. You? Dickhead. Got a little bit of a journey ahead of us. No, wrong button. But, uh... Got some good stuff on the way, though. On the other journey to, uh... The other side of the island. We got this helmet. We got this shield. And we got this nice cape. The cape doesn't do anything for us. No, it's just for looks. But the, sh the helmet and the shield are very good. Those are very good finds. I wish I could find a better shield that goes well, goes better with my armor. But that's not a big deal. Anyway, we are off towards uh, Fort, or Moon Moth Legion Fort. I'll see everyone when we get there, or when something fun happens. See you soon.